be going over how to make a simple flashlight um, activity uh, through Eclipse. Uh, you watched some of my previous videos. I'll show you how to download Eclipse in the SDKs. So uh, let's get started. Um, I'm going to make a new uh, dynamic web project. And uh, name it uh, R. I'm thinking of JSP right now, excuse me. <laughs> you want to make a new Android project. And uh, we're going to name this Flashlight. And uh, I'm going to put it in Android 2133. <clears throat> Then you gotta push, push, on, finish. Ooh. Um, if you don't know, um, it comes with a simple uh, hello, a hello app. And, um, basically, you're gonna see this output. It. So if you run this like as is, run as an Android application, you're gonna see it's gonna take a little bit of time to load, but in meanwhile, so we can mess with this and title <coughs> then create a new line named this blue title. Blue. And then the app name can stay the same. And then over here in the values, you want to create a colors XML folder file to hold our colors for our flashlight. And myself, Android XML. And just name this colors uh, XML. And uh, we're going to call this color name. And equals uh, red background. And uh, we're going to put the, um, the hue in for uh, red. Oh, too many. Yeah. All right, name this blue background and call this put the F's at the end for blue okay and then we're going to go through our layouts and then still loading um, I don't know why it's taking that long, but uh, you see, you have the main vertical layout, very apparent, very apparent, and uh, that was the original text that we wanted. Um, now we want our main page to be red, so we will put at at string red title. And uh, I'm getting the spinning wheel of death. Uh, how long are you going to last on me? Uh, okay. All right. Then we want to add Android. Um, XML is uh, white space sensitive, so make sure you don't put a space in between the, the, um, the, co the colon and the gravity. I'm going to add gravity equals um, bottom. Um, center horizontal, and then we're gonna put Android background. Okay, type today as uh, red background, or you gotta put at color. Red, red background. Let's 
still mode. I don't know what's taking it so long. And uh, for the main, we want to have a button on the main, um, a button to transfer it over to the blue, to the blue side. So I'm gonna create a button and uh, same from up top, Android layout with. Equal. Um, we're gonna make the the width fill parent. And then we're gonna make the layout height wrap content. Um, up here where we put the bottom center horizontal, that's refer reference to the button where the button's gonna be. It's gonna be at the bottom um, center. Um, it's a, it's a lot of options you can uh, put it at. Um, I just like it at the bottom. Top of the way. Then we're gonna put Android text equals. We're gonna put the string uh, blue title. And uh, up top we need to make the ID. This is very uh, important because when you call the button, you're gonna in the um, the on click listener you have to call it by by the button you added about at. Add the ID. This ID slash uh, we're in this blue button. Um, and then uh, I think the, the has loaded. I mean, we can uh, run the uh, the flashlight activity of what we have so far. And uh, we're gonna have our main screen as red. There we have an error, a name. Uh, oh, we have a duplicate attribute. Alright, it's a wrap content. Save that. And now we're just going to run the, this. Uh, and you see that is uh, a red. Red screen coming up. This is the end of part one. Um, watch part two. Uh, go to my channel. We're going to finish up that. Thank you for um, watching this video. Uh, subscribe to Technoformers. Uh, check out technoformers.com. Um, thank you. Have a nice day.